What is up y'all? Welcome to my bathroom. As you can see, this is going to be like a little bit of a different video. I'm going to show you guys how to line your beard like the barbers do it. As you can see, my hair is scraggly, you know. Uh, what I like to do is I let my stuff grow out. Well, I let my hair, my facial hair grow out for like two days at a time. That way you get the best lining possible. I know a lot of people like to keep theirs Chris lined up, but you, you know, I don't care with the little the little scraggly look for a little while to let it uh, grow out, you know? So um, today, I used to go to the barber all the time, get a lining, but uh, as you can see, my hair started to fall out. Uh, I did a video on that, and I just stopped going. I started doing it myself, start shaving my head myself. So yeah, let's get into it. These are the clippers I got. You know, they're the Adidas, T-liners or whatever, um, you can get them on Amazon, they're like $60, great investment because I don't know how much, but going to the barber is time consuming and it costs a lot of money. First thing you want to do is uh, train your beard, train your beard how you want it to grow, you know? See, I got it trained on this side, like, I don't have it even on both sides, like this side goes and that side goes, you know? <laughs> So uh, you gotta train your beard to how you want it to grow, you know? So what I like to do is, this is two days without lining it up, you know? Uh, you get it a little wet, you gotta get it wet first, you know? And as you can see, my beard is all wet, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I like to take a comb, you know? Uh, comb it out to the way you want it, you know? Uh, I use wood combs, cause I read up on beard growth and I heard like plastic combs rip out your hair, so I recommend getting a wood comb. I've been using it for years. Works perfect for me. You can get any type of wood comb. It doesn't have to be a certain brand. I got this one off of Amazon too, you know. I'm an Amazon junkie, but yeah. <laughs> so you just want to comb it out, you know, because it's nappy. You want to get the line professional looking, you know. Comb it out. And when you're combing it out, you know, comb it so your beard hair goes down so you can see the whole little thing, you know. Now as you can see, I don't comb it like all the way, I don't care about this side, I'm just lining it up. So I comb it so I can see the, you know, stuff right there, right there. I already got my beard trained. If I told you about how to grow a beard, uh, you can train your beard to how you want it to grow, you know. If you're in the stages of growing a beard, always line it the way you want it trained to grow, you know, so that's what I did. And over the years of doing it myself, when I first started out, I was messing it up and going too low, but I finally get the hang of it. Practice makes perfect, you know? You're gonna have to go through that phase of practicing if you wanna be good at anything. So yeah, also, I like to take this. I know I said don't use plastic combs, but I use this for my mustache. I uh, comb my mustache out, you know? And I'm looking in the mirror, that's why I'm not looking at the camera. But comb my mustache to get all those like loose hairs around your lip. So yeah, this is to get like the perfect lining like the barbers do, you know. Um, yeah. So I take my clippers. You see, I already got my I already got my my line where I go, so it's not really hard for me to line it up, you know. I just it's like tracing a stencil. If you got your beard trained, it's like a stencil, you know. You just go over where the ingrown hair is at, you know. So like the start, I stand back and look at the mirror, you know, like the start with the, the mustache first, you know, the mustache. I like to get up close, that's why I'm not uh, directly in the, in the shot, but you can see through the mirror, you know. As you can see, I got that side done, you know, boom, look at that, greatness, you know. That side's done. I always want to start with one side. I do one side first. The key is to not to push too hard. You don't want to push too hard on it, you know? Now we're going to do the other side. Or we're going to do the bottom of the beard. Boom. And we done. As you can see, I got the clean lining, crisp lining. What I want to do is I'm going to take a shower real quick. And then I'm going to uh, show you guys... Uh, the after effect because when you wash all the straggly away you see the 
crisp lining, you know. You can try this out. It will, you know, save you some money, some time. I know sitting at the barbershop takes forever. That's why I stopped. Plus, I lost my hair. So, I was like, why am I going to keep spending money on a barber, you know. But, yeah. Let me get in the shower and come back. Boom. Welcome back, y'all. Welcome back to the bathroom, you know. So, look. Fresh out the shower. Um, what I do is I like to leave my beard a little damp, you know. Because, you know, it keeps a little moisture in it. I got this beard oil. A lot of people use like beard balm. I don't know if you can see that. I got that on Amazon too. Amazon Junkie, as I said before. Um, what I do is, you know, it's a dropper thing. So I get like a full little tube of this. Drop here, drop there, drop there, you know, a little more. Drop it up. And this like keeps the beard like, like moist. Um, not moist, it keeps the beard like soft and, and shiny, gives it that real nice beard look, you know? Rub it around in there, you know? Put, get a little of my mustache, rub it around real good. Boom. Make sure it gets all throughout the beard in there. Bam, that's all you gotta do, you know? And this could be for like people just starting out with a beard or whatever, you know? You don't need a full beard like mine. This took me like a year to grow, you know? So, comb it out, style it to the way you want it. Always comb the, the sides down, you know? When I first started, I used to comb it up. I don't know, it looks stupid. And then you just you want you know you want to pat it to like all the all the sticking out hairs, pat it down to the way you want it. That's what I usually do. Boom, 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 boom. Get all this stuck in, stuck out hairs. You know. Every two week, every like three weeks or so, I do maintenance on the beard. You know, cut the stragglers, but usually I just let be. Bam! Look at it. Shiny, nice, crisp lining, you see it? Crisp. That's how you line your beard like the barbers do it. Um, you wanna try it out? Go ahead. That's my whole full little beard routine. Appreciate you guys for watching. Peace.